Adult literacy uh, is an opportunity to, to really, hopefully, make a huge difference in the lives of not only those individuals who are being trained, but also for their families and their connections in the community. Lives really are changed as we've seen in the statements of some of our students tonight. You know, I volunteered there because I wanted to do something that would make a difference in someone's life and it's, reading is something I've always done since I can remember and it's hard to imagine someone not being able to do that. So I take a couple hours a week and I can share that with someone and make their life so much easier by just a couple hours a week, it's hardly anything. I um, left a, a career that was very important to me about three years ago. I had been a children's minister for a very, very long, most of my adult life. And I left the role um, in the church. Um, I had some family concerns. My father was terminally ill, and I wanted to be his primary caregiver. So as I walked away from a career that I deeply loved, and, and my role there was primarily in, in teaching and then passing on a philosophy of education to, I managed about 150 volunteers at that job. So when I walked away from that, it was very difficult. And so I wasn't away from that job for very long, and I really had an itch to be teaching again. But I knew as I was caring for my dad that I couldn't really get involved in another career role. And so I started to just feel out some volunteer positions that might just be a couple hours a week. And I actually put um, my resume out in so many different directions, you know, and, and so many people were expressing needs for volunteers, but they didn't have the administrative, administrative savvy to really take volunteers and get them working. And so, but with, as soon as I con connected with literacy volunteers, they were just beginning a training, like two weeks after I had contacted them. And um, I started that training. Five weeks later, I was trained as a tutor. Within two weeks, I got information about Nan in the mail, and her and I hit the ground running. It was amazing. And I was so thrilled that literacy volunteers, their, their structure, their administrative structure was such that they had you know, me with my skill set, my passions, and my desire to connect with another person. And they just had a nice network that just got me to work very quickly. For 25 years, I was the chair for the Center of Continuing Education at Casanova College. So my uh, whole life career as an educator was to work with adults and adults who didn't have a chance you know, to be educated when they were 18 or 19. So that was the population I was comfortable with. And so when I decided to not commute to Casanova anymore after 25 years, I still wanted to stay within the field of education. So I knew that this would be a good fit. And then the question was, do I work with refugees or do I work with people needing literacy uh, who lived in the community? And I decided that to enrich myself as much as the students that I would just work with refugees.